Warm up today, again, starting with that running warm up, 200 meter jog, out to that mark, back in. After that, 30 seconds, or about 10 total of our Samson's. Again, lunge, reach, a little bit of a twist, switching legs, every rep, and working through that. After that, getting into that runner's lunge, or that Spider-Man lunge, all the way down, elbow tries to touch the ground, turn, face that knee. Again, switching and working through the other side. After that, 30 seconds of knee grabs, grabbing and squeezing, working on that balance to get everything nice and tight. After that, 30 seconds of foot grabs, 30 seconds of high knees, and then 30 seconds of butt kicks. That will be our warm up for our run conditioning. After that, after our run conditioning, we're gonna come back, warm up the dumbbell a little bit because we do have some dumbbell snatch in our workout. So again, starting with six alternating sumo deadlift with our dumbbell. After our six, six high pulls with that dumbbell. And then after that, six alternating dumbbell snatches. And then after our six alternating dumbbell snatches, finding a box, a chair, a stool, six body weight step ups. Conditioning today, working again on that running, working through some interval distances, so changing it up a little bit from what we've been doing for the past couple of weeks. It is three rounds of a 200 meter run, a 400 meter run, and then an 800 meter run. The way that it's gonna work, we're gonna try and build in some equal work to equal rest. So on the zero, Three, two, one, go. 200 meter run. Out and in, fine. At the two, we're going out for that 400 meter run. And then again, at the six, we're going out for that 800 meter run. So basically, we're trying to cut those numbers in half to try and get equal work to equal rest. So you have about a minute to run your 200 to get one minute of rest. About two minutes to run your 400 to get two minutes of rest. And then we're taking about four minutes of work for that 800 to then get about three minutes of rest to start over again, because then round number two of that 200 starts at the 13, and we'll work through our 200, our 400, and our 600, and then round number three starts at the 26 for our 200, our 400, and our 800. Mobility today, starting with again that sit and reach. It's nice long legs if we're able, reach and touch your toes. We'll hold for about a minute. If we can't quite touch our toes, feel free to bend the knees a little bit holding here for about 30 seconds, and then after kind of loosening up a little bit more, trying to flatten those legs best that we can to finish out that minute. After our sit and reach, we're gonna go into that seated straddle, or sorry, seated saddle. So legs stay a little bit wide, looking to stretch out those quads, leaning back as far as we can, get those quads and the hip flexor stretched out. And then after our saddle, then we'll go into that seated straddle. So again, legs nice and wide. If you have a weight or a pull that you want to hold on to to kind of get that full extension out the front, even better, just looking to stretch out those hamstrings and that low back just a little bit. 